So what are you doing, honey? I'm building my little compartment for my That's bedroom. practically a room down there. Yeah. How far back does it go? Going back, this will be the wall here, and then it'll go smaller over to the window. Right. Because I got uh I will have to build a little roof because actually that's outside and I have to be able to keep the Moisture water. Off. Yeah. Uh, so that would awesome. be my next plan. Yep. Anyway, we'll be back later to see how you're progressing. You got time for a pot of coffee? Yes, I can always make you a pot of coffee. You. You're welcome. Alrighty. We got our uh, all walled in. Over here, I just got it temporarily closed off until I build the, the little crawl space out to the basement. I got it all insulated, vapor barriered. I'll finish these walls off with the chipboard after. But right now, it's uh, good enough for today. Hey, Baba. Hello. What you doing? Hooking up the batteries. I got a question for you. If my wood stove's in that corner, why would we need a, he uh, a baseboard heater? It's probably coming down here. The baseboard heater? Yes. That's a good idea. I think so. You figured out how you're going to heat that hole without breaking through to the basement. Yeah, we're keeping, still having the conduit going through the basement, but just a smaller way to get in there. That's all. Good job. Well, there's the day's work. <laughs> Batteries are in. All hooked up uh, for 24 volt. Uh, and up here we have the new 5000 watt pure sine wave inverter. The old 3000 watt, which is going to power just the well on um, its own 12 volt battery bank. This one's going to run the rest of the house on uh, the 24 volt. Um, we have our Santrax 60 MPPT for our panels. And I have the uh, Xantrex C60, which right now I'm going to put a solar panel on. We're going to see if that's going to be enough to power it. I don't know if it's going to be enough to charge the 12 volt batteries, but we shall see. Uh, all my circuit breakers, wires, all that stuff that I've been doing today. Yeah, all worked out pretty good. Good day's work. Uh, I still need a new fuse for the other one. That's, we're getting there. Okay, <coughs> here we are again. We got our two 12 volts down there that we're going to run the well pump solely on. Batteries all in 24 volts. All the breakers and everything in place. Charge controller. And we're ready to fire it up. I just have it hooked up to a panel that Jane all sent us. I'm hoping it's going to be enough to charge, but it's uh, the small one there, the 120. And <coughs> I may have to get another 120 to, to match it up, I'm not sure, but uh, we'll see how it works. Everything's plugged in, wired up, <coughs> excuse me, ready to go. Alrighty, well, everything's working uh, good. The panel, uh, it's doing uh, okay, 5 amps, it's charging the battery, it's now up to 12.6, it was at 12 when I first started it, so uh, yeah, it's uh, for one panel, well, it should do okay, as long as the sun's shining, and eventually I'll grow my 12 volt bank a little bit more, and we're going to be adding the wind turbine, and hopefully it adds to uh, our collecting of uh, power. Well, that's it. Bye-bye.